My name is James Newton, and this is my science fair. So I think that this should make probably 90% of the people in this experiment at least 10 seconds faster. So what I did was I gathered eight people, including me, and mapped out a course. I then picked two different days with as, sim as similar weather conditions as possible. Two different days for two different trials. One day would be without music, and the second one would be with music. After I record all the times, I compared them to see if the music was faster, slower, or the same. So the total distance that we ended up running was just over 1.1 miles, as you can see marked by the white line on this picture right here. So the first day was with no music, and uh, it was around 40 degrees, it was 45% humidity, and we started the run at 3.20 p.m. And uh, as you can see by the um, data up here, uh, most people got around 9, 9.5 minutes or so. We had a couple below, and a couple get more. So the second day, which was with music, was 47 degrees, 53% humidity, and we started the run at 11 a.m. So what you see here is uh, I basically just took the difference between the trial with music and the trial without music. And uh, actually, a lot of people improved by quite a bit. We had three people that improved by over a minute, a uh, couple one seconds, then the rest were around 20. We had one person, though that actually went slower by 25 seconds. So, uh, I mean, the result to this is that most people, seven out of eight people in this case, uh, music will actually help them run faster 